Hey, what's up everybody? It's your boy Subway Cookie and welcome to another video. Today we're going to be doing a little bit, something a little bit different. So we're going to be starting our hitbox training today and as you can see we are in MK11. Um, I figured we'd start off with MK11 because it's um, um, the basic, the, the movement, the, the buttons I guess are a lot more um, simple. So for example to do an ice ball is just down forward instead of quarter circle forward punt. Like down forward punch instead of quarter circle forward punch if you know what I mean so um, yeah so that's what we're gonna do um, just so I can get used to using this thing uh, we're gonna start on our basic movement so just just forward dash back dash forward jump back jump um, raw specials and then t learning the basic string so I'll be practicing that um, doing those things Maybe ten times in a row. <laughs> ten times in a row. Hold on, let me, I'll reply to Koa later. Sorry, dude. Um, so I'll be doing those things ten times in a row just to get that practice, just to get my my muscles, uh, that muscle memory down pat. Um, yeah. So because it's gonna be very different. Um, it's very different from using a pad. So that's why. Um, so I'm gonna start it off easy. So 10, and then I'll see how many times I get it and then within count of 10. Um, we'll keep doing that for the whole week, um, and we'll see the accuracy, re review the accuracy uh, from how I, wh how I was at the start of the week, and then compare it to the end of the week. You know, are we going to move forward? Are we going to change it up? Kind of things, and we'll review that uh, maybe on the Friday, Friday of the week, um, and see how we can move forward. Um, in, in our progression in our progression <laughs> with the hitbox so yeah um, let's start off uh, let's reset this first so let's we'll start off with our basic forward dash so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 back dash 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 100% so far so one. Oh, I'm not getting the forward jump. One. Wait, how many times have I done that already? Let's, let's just start again. So, one. No, two, three. One out of three. One out of four. One out of five. Two out of six. Two out of seven. Well, it's technically a back jump, but it's the direction I'm trying to go. 3 out of 8, 4 out of 9, oops, and 4 out of 10, so that's 40%. Let me just take note of that on my PC. 4 out of 10, whoops, <laughs> it's taking it down as a date, um, 40%, okay. Alright, backwards jump, which is technically, yep, go on. One out of two, one out of three. Um, that's, I swear that's two out of five, two out of six, two out, uh, three out of seven, four out of eight, five out of nine, five out of ten, so 50%. Um, okay. All right, moving on, moving forward. Ice ball. One, two, three, four, five. Um, five out of seven. Eight. Five out of nine. Six out of ten. So about sixty percent. Um, I think what I'm doing there is I'm doing it a bit too. Maybe I was doing it too too late on those ones. Oh, there we go. See the direction. If you look 
that's how clean I want it. None of the direction, the, the diagonal showing up. So the reason why it was the diagonal was showing up. Okay, anyways, um, other side. Oops, <laughs> wrong thing. Um, there's an easy way to switch, easier way to switch sides, but that's cool. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Looks like, looks like my movement from my middle finger to my ring finger is okay. It's just middle finger to the pointer finger is fine. So that was 100% out of 10. Anyway, so, yep, that's good, that's good, that's good, that's good. Hold on. Alright, so now it's the amplifiers. So... So we'll do that amplified, so this is my my L1. This is my R1 button. Okay. Mm-hmm. So we'll start on this side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Alright, hundred percent again. So we'll start on the other side this time. Okay, 100%. Okay. I think because I figured out what it was that I was doing wrong, that's why I was able to get that 100%. Uh, but we'll see how we go. So next is cold shoulder. So let's reset. Cold shoulder is uh, three. One, two, oh, three out of four. Three out of five. 3 out of 6. Am I not doing it fast enough? Yep, yeah, not doing it fast enough. Three out of six. So that's 4 out of 7. 4 out of 8. 4 out of 9. 5 out of 9. And then five, uh, 6 out of 10. So that's 60%. Other side. Okay, well, it looks like, <laughs> just like with the pad, um, my second, my two-player side is much stronger than my first first player side, which is weird. So that was 100%. Again, similar results. Okay, now let's sh shoulder amplify. Okay, just making sure that I got the right button. One. Two, three, four. I think it's pretty much the same issue. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, one hundred percent. Looks like the same results again. Okay, and then other side. Oops, didn't mean to press that. One, two, technically two out of three, because I tried it and nothing came out. Uh, three out of four. Three out of five. Oh no, four out of five. Five out of six. I got it. Uh, six out of seven. <laughs> seven out of eight. Seven out of nine. 
I mean, eight out of nine. Nine out of ten. So, ninety percent. All right. Next, let's move on to the strings. So, one, two. One, two. Start off with eight frames. Eight, nine. No, oh, I wasn't counting. Sorry. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. I don't think we need to practice sides per se for this one because it's the same. Oops. Um, one, two, three. Oops. Oh, one, two, four. Sorry, should be one, two, four, not one, two, three. I put it down as the wrong thing. Okay, uh, now that we know that, let's try that again. One, two, four. One, four, two, three, four, five, six, six out of seven, six out of seven out of eight. I mean. Six out of eight. Eight out of nine. Uh, nine out of ten. So ninety percent. Um, back four. Uh, back one four. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh. Oh, my button stuffed. That's why. <laughs> oh no. It's like I'll have to open it up and fix it. Hold on a sec. Damn. Eh, that's okay. Um, so I'll show you what happened. So this part of the button. So well, that's the part that kind of clips. So note to self, I'm not gonna buy clip clip buttons. I'll buy the screw buttons instead. I think Sanwa do the screw buttons, but if not, um, I can have a look and see what what buttons. Okay, back to it. So it was back one four. So that works fine. Okay. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ten. <laughs> yeah, but sorry, I'm getting ahead of myself. Um, yeah, so back back one four. I think we did um, seven eighty percent. I'd say eighty percent. I'll go back and do it. All right. Actually, I might have to do that one on both sides. One, two, three, four, five, six. feel right okay so that's hundred percent so back one four back one four three so oops that's not the wrong one so zero out of one back one four three okay Ten. 
good. Okay. And other side. Cool, 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 100% again. 2 1. Easy. 2 three. Oops. Fast enough. Hmm. Okay, sorry. Yep. Two one two. Pushback in this pushback pushback in this game. Um, I'm still like I've been mashing this for a while and I'm, it's I'm still here. Sorry, I'm just <laughs> practicing random crap now. Um, so we did two one percent. Um, don't need to do that both sides. Two one two. I'm pretty sure we did one hundred percent. Let's see if we can go. That's weird. With the hitbox, I have to commit to it. Maybe later on, when I get bit, a bit better at this, I don't have to commit.
Sorry, anyways, back one, two. <laughs> mid, mid. So, four, two, four. Boom. Say about ninety percent because I tried. Yeah. So ninety percent. Need to practice on that because that's a big deal, um, especially the four two into ice ball. I'm finding that. On pad, I can kind of think about it before having to go into the ice ball. But on the hitbox, um, I think it's because my mus my mem muscle memory is not there, and also like I kind of flash down, look at my thing, make sure I'm pressing it properly, and then um, doing it um, during the ice ball, it kind of takes away. So it's like. Um, it's like I blink almost before I do that. Like now that I mentioned it, I'm not doing it, but. It's a smaller window for me to react. Like if that hits, usually I'd probably just go into that. Or but I mean, either way I'm dead. Like, if they block, I'm screwed. Anyways, um, 3-3. Three, three. Boom, boom. Boom, high mid. Oh, that looks like a low, but it's a mid. Alright. Back to 2. Back to 2-1. Two, smaller window for me to react because I have to input that much faster The only thing I think I need to practice as well now um, is not only that, but these buttons. So the trigger buttons. So I don't normally use these two fingers. Um, and I need to if I want to use this. Um, like I'll normally just use these front two. I probably should start using my thumb as well. Yeah, that's better.
Yeah, that's much better actually. I should have instead of using this finger. So what I was what I was doing before, I was using my pointer finger for X, but really I should just be resting my thumb on that, shouldn't I? So Yeah, now it's Yeah, now it's so much better. I need to practice better posture um, for my fingers. Good, good. So that we're learning. So it's not just the inputs that we're learning about. It's just how flexible, how, how much better I can make the experience for myself. Um, especially when I, the way I hold the buttons, the way my fingers are on top of the buttons um, is, is, it makes a difference. Oh, that's why it's a mid. Boom. Boom. <laughs> All right. Anyways, um, I know it's a long-winded video, but I hope what you are able to take away from the video is that if you need to work on if you're changing a controller whether it be from a stick to a pad um, don't be afraid to take it slow because um, i find when i take things too fast uh, i feel as though i should be much better but i'm not much better <laughs> um than what i am but if i take it slow i'm able to figure out like those things like i was taking it slow i was able to figure out what what, what, what i was doing wrong instead of resting my thumb on the X button I was using my pointer finger um, to press X and that was costing me a few uh, few seconds also I learned that my player 2 side is much better than my player 1 side which, which is actually the same on pad um, so there's that I need to strengthen my ring fingers and my pinkies um, just be able to use that use that movement it's probably might take a while because I don't really use them but I've got the other stuff down packed so yeah um, I think moving forward we're still gonna keep we're still gonna keep the same um, training but I think we're gonna apply different things and then maybe next week if everything is all good we can start learning or maybe even during the week we can just start learning combos we'll see how we go i think maybe like even just one bnb combo oh sorry maybe just one bnb combo might be might be good to put in there so i'll i'll figure out which one i should learn i think i should probably learn that one the schmix especially because it's I have to amplify. Bop, bop. Yeah, so I'm slowly getting the hang of it. Um, anyways, thank you for watching. Hope this video, you found this video helpful. Um, and Hopefully I'll be able to do these kinds of things live stream because I know it's kind of boring, um, especially for me because I'm just talking to myself. <laughs> talking to myself. But hopefully um, you find, found this video useful. And thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.